Hi, my name is Greg Paglia. I'm with West Roofing Systems and welcome to another edition of Whiteboard Roofing. Today's episode, we're gonna talk about uh, our value and how much will spray polyurethane foam um, add onto a roof. So first of all, our value with spray foam, it's around 6.5 per inch of thickness. So one inch is 6.5, two inches would be uh, 13, and so on and so forth. It's the highest R value per inch of thickness of any roofing insulation out there. Um, someone called and asked, you know, how much R value would be on my roof if I applied two inches of foam? Well, it depends on what your existing roof is. If it's in good condition and we're not removing anything, um, just whatever you have already there, just add 6.5 per inch onto that. A uh, common example would be a TPO roof with two inches of polyiso insulation underneath. Polyiso, um, that'd be an R11. So if you had two inches of foam on top of that, you'd have an R24. Um, another scenario that comes up is a roof that's in bad condition, um, which means it has a lot of the insulation is saturated. Uh, we'd remove all that down to the deck so you'd have an R value of zero, and then just add 6.5 per inch um, on top of that. So um, one thing you have to keep in mind if your roof does need to be removed is building codes. There's a minimum R value um, requirements. I think in Cleveland it's an R20 or an R25, I believe. So you would need three, three and a half, four inches of foam on top of that roof. Um, if you're not removing stuff down to the deck, uh, you can pretty much just spray over top and there's no minimum R value requirement. Then there's a question about, you know, I just want to put 15 inches of foam on there because I want the best R value, um, but really it's not cost effective. There's a certain parameter. Usually it's between two and four inches of foam. Um, after that, it's just not cost effective to add any more R value because you're not going to insulate your building anymore. Um, and last thing, um, people ask me, you know, besides R value, why do people even choose spray foam as a roof? Uh, number one thing is, you don't have to rip off the entire roof. If your roof's in decent condition, you just remove the wet areas. So it reduces the cost of your project and speed. Uh, a lot of times um, people want the roof done quick with a lot of, not a lot of interruption. And foam such as spray applied can be put down, you know, half to a third faster than you know everybody else, or two to three times faster than everybody else or other roofing systems. So that's it. If you have any questions about our value and spray foam or what's required for your roof, uh, please let me know. Be happy to answer any questions you have. Thank you so much, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.